A Vision in a poem by the Reverend John Wright Follet. The sullen canopy of night was rent, the shadows dim were fleeing last away. The faintest light of dawn flushed in the east, a promise of the birth and light of day. And as I looked, a glory filled the sky, ten thousand shafts of light pierced through the gloom. If all this blaze were but the break of day, I cannot sense the brightness of its noon. Still brighter grew the light as fold on fold, down fell the tattered curtains of the night. No longer could they hide the rising sun, the day lay bare his breast in morning light. And while my heart was ravished by the sight, a filmy veil of smoke began to rise up from the million chimney throats of earth until a murky curtain draped the skies. I saw the furnaces belch forth their breath in clouds of soot and smoke until the air was filled as with the darkness of the night and hid the light which breaks so bright and fair. The vision filled with men bent low by toil. I heard the moan of women tired and worn. The cry of little children reached my ear. The whole creation seemed so sick and torn. The babes were hurried from their mother's breast and robbed of childhood's sunny hours and play, went joyless to their work through sultry noon till early nightfall closed their little day. There was no time to give a heavenward look, for they must toil as slaves beneath the lash, scourged to the round of duties of life's day, their eyes so dull they could not see the flash of light celestial from the Father given, the heaven all aglow with truth and grace, the dawning of the promised day of rest, revealed in Christ, God's gift to all the race. The horror, like a nightmare, gripped my heart, and crying sore with my heart, I said, My God, is this the destiny of man, that he should labor thus to earn his bread?